Good afternoon, my name is Dr. Alex Fernandez, chiropractor located on 8500 Kennedy Boulevard. And today we're gonna talk about a topic that gets asked very often here at the office is, Doc, how do I fix my bad posture? What are some of the things that you could do at home to fix your own bad posture? Let's talk about what bad posture looks like. So I'm gonna demonstrate with myself. This is something that's happening very, very much so these days. People are bending forward, they're rounding at the shoulders and they're walking around like this and the number one reason that that's happening is because people are looking down with their cell phone all day long and this is producing a lot of very very bad posture to the point where it's causing a lot of pain on people that we didn't experience in the past so what does bad posture look like so aside from what I just showed you here is a poster and I have the same guy in three different poses we have good posture here, nice good alignment, blue line, everything is going right through the center. We have the next one, which is a so-so, but still beginning of bad posture. The center of gravity is off, and that's told by this uh, red line here. It's not going through his shoulder. And then of course, the very, very poor posture that I'm seeing more and more commonly these days, where this is really going forward, the shoulders are rounded, and this is what creates lots of stress and tension in the shoulders and in the neck. So now that we discover how bad that problem is, what the problem looks like, let's show you some of the things that we can do at home, which are very easy. You don't need a whole lot of uh, specialized equipment. Uh, I'm gonna show you here what we do at the office. So one of the things we try to do is we try to stretch out what we call the chest muscles, your pectoralis muscles, and the way that we do it is we have the Swiss ladder here. We have the patient grab on and we stretch and we look the opposite way. So what is this exactly doing? It's stretching this entire area where it's been contracted for a long period of time. It's gonna help open this up. That's step number one. At home, what's the equivalent? You're gonna grab a wall, okay? And in the wall, we're going to do the following. And you can come around Alex so people can see. All right, so what's gonna happen is we're gonna do the same pretty much function, and if I want more effect, I'm gonna look to the opposite way. How long are we holding this for? For 15 seconds. So we hold for 15 seconds, and then we turn and we do the opposite way. Come around this way. And again, what's happening? We are stretching those muscles that are contracted. Very, very simple. So that's step number one. The second exercise that you want to do is going to address the forward head posture. And the way that we're going to do that is we're going to use a very simple block. If you don't have this, you can use a yoga block, not a problem. And basically what you do is we're going to position ourselves and you can come around to this side out so they can see. In this area here, we're going to be positioned in this, in this manner and we're going to do what we call a cervical extension. So we are going to stretch the neck back. We're going to do this slowly. And what we're trying to accomplish is to stretch out all the muscles in here that have been contracted from you with the poor posture. And we're going to give those muscles in the back a break who have been overstretched for a long period of time. So by doing this, we're going to really start to stretch things out in the beginning you may feel that this is difficult but as the days go along and you're doing this more often it will get easier to do so your goal is to really end up touching the back of this wall without of course hurting yourself now we start this in repetitions of 25 then we up it to 50 75 100 until we get to the point where we do 200 okay now if you're experiencing neck pain or shoulder pain, obviously you need a professional opinion before you begin these exercises. But if you have none of that and you just have poor, bad posture, then you can begin these exercises. Now, to recap again, what are we trying to do? Open up the muscles here, open up the muscles in this area, all along your neck. And again, we are going to stretch, 15 second hold, and we're going to do our neck extensions.
Okay? So with those two exercises, that is part of the formula that's going to help you with your core posture. Thank you.